fishing. Stick. Yeah, look at them. Look at that line. See? That's the joy of it. Make it up. That's wrong. That's not so bad. Oh, that's, is it? Oh, I wouldn't have said that was all that good. Seems like I'm going with it. Hey, just join over it. It's like, I don't know. Coming in. I think the best bit's coming up in a minute. The best bit of the, this old drawing that I found was the most satisfying bit. I think it's coming up. I'll let you know. Look at that, that's not very good. Got to keep doing things a few times. Control Z, Control Z, Control Z. Oh god. Look at that. That'll do, sod it. Missed. Missed. Oh god. Jeez, come on. Ah, oh, that's better, that'll do it. Back that under there, Luke, get his breezes in. Like, I don't know, it must have been the turn of the century when a man was judged by his breezes. I'd have been ostracised from society as I grow a very poor breezer. Colouring in his chamber pot on his head there. Look at them little lines, very delicate. Never think of chamber pots being having delicate lines, but I'm sure they do. I'm sure Mr. Chamber Pot would often compliment Mrs. Chamber Pot on her lovely delicate lines. Look at that, that missed. It doesn't matter though. Look, that hit, but I'll go with that one. Where's that round the top? Nice steady base on your chamber pot. I think is essential. Stop any unfortunate spills. You know, kinds of filth on your slippers in the morning. Look at that, the cheeky breezes peeping out from behind his. his oh, there it is, there's the best bit, look. Come and have a look. That's, I dig that, look at that. Look. I want to point it out to you. That's an accident. Happy accident. Sketching, full of happy accidents, that's what it's all about. Sketching so for fun, right? Colouring in, that's uh, <laughs> there you go. Colouring, I try and keep it in the lines. A conventional sort of fellow in that direction. Rubbing out a bit of that as if I know what I'm doing. And a bit there, Luke. Probably could have got away with that. Nobody would have noticed. Oop, oh, too much. Is it really necessary? Wiggling around now, I'm wondering, I guess, wondering what I'm doing. I'm gonna rub that out, I think. Yeah, rub that out. Doesn't match the other side, but then what do you replace it with, you know? It's all very well spotting problems. You gotta solve them. That's not right. Oh no. Nope. Oh my. There you are, my giddy aunt. Just don't like, if you see any false moves or anything suspicious, just don't mention anything. Put his ear in there, I'll take mine off it. Whoop. See, that's how colouring him works. You can press some things, colouring his elbow. What an uncolouring elbow, really. What am I doing there then? Select that. That was an accident. Select that again. Move it, move that over there. There you go, I've got to fix that shoulder because it appears to be coming out of his ribs. Whoa! That bird's back, there's a sketch, just a recap on what I thought I was doing. Where I put his shoulder before. Yeah, whap that in. Click, click. Yeah, yeah that's better. Kind of cheap, he's got a kind of crazy kink in his arm, whatever. I'm do the trick. Yeah, oh, what's that? Okay. Colour, there you go. Colour that in. It's alright, move that around. Colour that in. You don't want to see this, this surely someone must be some kind of way to edit this rubbish out. No, that doesn't appear too cool now, does it? Pants. You can't go on with half 
plus three. And your mum didn't pack your egg sandwiches for your dinner, for your lunch. Look at that! Right around there. Right, very therapeutic, see, coiling in things. You can dress the. Oh, did he put skin on his eye? Look at that, I'll get sure of that. Right, yeah. Can't see much with skin on your eye. As you know, if you've ever. Shut your eyes. Find out what's going on. Make that like that. Okay, coiling in the chamber pot there. You gotta, they always kind of. Uh, subtle colours, those chamber pots. Kind of summery, well, like a summer late afternoon, I guess, when you might be feeling like you want to go and sit on the chamber pot. Go on and handle in. Wiggle, wiggle. What's going on now? Oh, there you go, jump. Look, look at the shades on and everything. Same nonsense. Look at that, that's some transparency look you see in the corner there. Here, I'll show you, it's on his pants. Different layer, obviously. Yeah. Different. The color of his pants sticking out. So you know the difference. Uh, click roll. Yeah, click. Look at that. Look at him there, robust. Robust fella. A lot of plum duff on board that ship. Sticking some hairs on his face. Hairy cheeks. There he knows. Oh, that's rubbish. Stick him some hairs on his finger. Always you gotta always test out your cartoon characters with hairy bits for some reason. Just the way it is. Right, what are we doing here? Look at that. Okay, stick him some more. Yeah, he's got a bit of a in it. This isn't his first voyage, you know. So he's probably probably got a bit of tint there on his whiskers, on his hair cut, like uh, Russell Crowe in uh, War Games or whatever it was called, oh well that was another guy wasn't it with a computer, I don't know, you know you know what I mean, look at that, that's alright, there you go, there's the fun of it, cheeky cheeky, shiny facey, although he's uh, let himself go with his barnet, obviously sticking to the navy rules on the queen chin. There you go, look at it for a while. Sort that out, look at that big fat line there, that's all there. Oh, well, very unfortunate, took it in like that. God is in the details. Move that at whoops. They're gonna stick a picture of a dog on the same felt. Then that well, then the admiral turns up. Look, there he is. Excuse me, I'm afraid you're completely non-navy regulation, and you're gonna to have to go. And uh, that's how drawing works. <laughs>